Hello everyone, and welcome to Fun To Be Free. Today's journey brings us to Disney's Art of Animation Resort. Coming up next. Hey explorers, John with Fun To Be Free inviting you to follow me as we discover fun together. Let's go! We're here at Disney's Art of Animation Resort where Disney characters jump off the animator's desk and come to life. Disney's Art of Animation is a value resort at the Walt Disney World Resort located in the Disney's Wide World of Sports area. It features four of Disney's popular character themes, including The Lion King, The Little Mermaid, Cars, and Finding Nemo. We're just headed into Animation Hall now, just up ahead. Here we are at Disney's Art of Animation Resort. We're going to go through these double doors here, and we're immediately greeted on the right-hand side with some artist concepts of popular Disney characters. On the opposite side, is the front desk for check-in. And we're going to proceed straight ahead to the gift shop. That's it, right up there, the ink and paint shop. Let's take a quick look at this oversized chandelier themed to artist concept animation. But if we look over to the left-hand side, there's a set of doors that takes us out to the Walt Disney World bus transportation. We're going to go check out the buses in a moment, but first, let's go look at the business center and what they have to offer. Here at the business center, they have some PCs and they have prepaid phone cards for international travelers. There's also an ATM and printers. Here's the exterior of the ink and paint shop themed to more artist concept of popular Disney movies. And we've come up to the ink and paint shop. Let's go take a look and see if they have any resort specific merchandise. We're gonna go through the entrance here we're going to look over to the right hand side and we're immediately greeted with Disney's Raya and the Last Dragon merchandise. But let's swing around the back side and see if there's any resort specific merchandise. And it sure does. It looks like we have some mugs themed to the art of animation. Let's see how much it is. It's $13.99. They also offer some hats, some photo frames, and this neat Ariel t-shirt. Let's see how much that is. It's $29.99. Let's take a look at the rest of the ink and paint shop before we go check out the bus transportation. And there's a merchandise register wrap. And we're gonna proceed straight ahead here through those double doors. Here's the merchandise wrap. And here's those double doors. We're gonna go through the exit right now. Here we go, through the double doors. Bus transportation from Disney's Art of Animation Resort is offered to all four theme parks, both of the water parks, and Disney Springs. Now that we've seen the bus stop, let's go back inside Animation Hall by going in the doors directly behind me, and let's go check out the landscape of flavors, the food court, here at Disney's Art of Animation. We're gonna go through these double sets of double doors back into Animation Hall and we're headed up to the ink and paint shop. We're gonna go through it just on the left-hand side and head into the landscape of flavors. Here we are at the landscape of flavors food court here at Disney's Art of Animation Resort. Let's go check out the menu and see what they have to offer. The landscape of flavors here at Disney's Art of Animation Resort has a couple of featured offerings including a Star Wars Lucasfilm 2021 Resort Refillable Drink Mug for $29.99 and a Cookies and Cream Sunday Cupcake for $5.49. They also offer a souvenir specialties like the Resort Refillable Mug for $19.99 and a couple of entrees like a roasted turkey dinner for $13.99 and a turkey sandwich for $10.99. We're gonna go through the entrance here and we're gonna head over to the mobile order pickup area. Just up ahead here is the mobile order pickup area. 
and off to the right hand side is the register queue. But let's continue and check out the table where you pick up your food. And here's the mobile order pickup area. Here's the register queue and register app. Directly behind the register queue and register app is the refillable drink mug and soda station. Here's some concept art of the Little Mermaid and located just over to my right hand side is another refillable drink mug and soda station complete with a microwave where you can warm up your own food. Now let's continue by going out these exit doors here and head over to the Lion King themed area. We're outside now. If we look over to our right hand side, there's the big blue pool. Let's take a quick look at the big blue pool before we go check out the Lion King themed area. Disney's Art of Animation Resort has a few recreation activities to offer, including Movie Under the Stars and Mickey Tie-Dye. Much like the other Disney Valley Resorts, oversized Disney icons are built around the resort on each of the 10 buildings' wings, which houses family suites. There are also three themed pools, and the Big Blue Pool is the largest hotel pool in all of Walt Disney World Resort. We've come up to a directory here at Disney's Art of Animation Resort. Disney's Art of Animation Resort sits on Hourglass Lake and features four themed areas throughout the resort, including The Lion King, The Little Mermaid, Cars, and Finding Nemo. The Lion King section of the resort features a natural setting, such as that found in the wilds of Africa. And here's a photo spot with Rafiki for the Junior Explorers. Hi, Rafiki. And there's Simba on Pride Rock. And here's Timon, Pumbaa, and Simba using a tree as a bridge out in the wilds of Africa. And here's the elephant graveyard with those vicious hyenas. And there's that maniacal scar. And don't forget Zazu. Let's go check out the Little Mermaid theme section just up ahead. We must be under the sea at the Little Mermaid area. The Little Mermaid section of the resort is themed to under the sea decorations. This section of the resort has exterior walkways where the other sections have enclosed interior walkways between the rooms. And here's a look at the exterior elevation of the Little Mermaid rooms. You could even get your photo with Prince Eric from the Little Mermaid. And there's Sebastian looking all musical. It certainly feels like we're under the sea. Just across the way is King Triton. Here's a look at the Little Mermaid section, exterior balcony, room door, and room plaque. If you look just down below, there's the Flippin' Fins Pool here at the Little Mermaid section. We're looking at it from the fourth floor exterior balcony. And just over here to the right are the restrooms and guest laundry. Just on the other side, is that conniving Ursula. And here's another look at the Flippin's Fin Pool just down below from the fourth story balcony here in the Little Mermaid section. And here's the star of the Little Mermaid, Ariel with Flounder. How cute. We've arrived at the Cars themed area. Let's go check it out. The Cars section of the resort is themed like the Cozy Cone Motel that was featured in the film. Resort buildings are themed with the movie's characters, including Lightning McQueen, Sally, Mater, and Luigi, and Guido. Radiator Springs, a happy place. And just down below is the sheriff. Watch your speeding coming into town. And just on the opposite side, Ornament Valley, Radiator Springs. And here's Doc, the Hudson Hornet. He could train you how to race. Ramon is just waiting to give you a custom paint job. Flo is welcoming you into Radiator Springs. Get your kicks on Route 66. If you need a place to stay, here's the Cozy Cone Motel. Here's Tow Mater's Towing and Salvage. And if you look just over here on the left hand side, there's Mater. Hi Mater. And there's Luigi and Guido. 
pit stop. There's Fillmore's organic fuel, and there's Fillmore himself. Here's Sarge's surplus hut, and directly on the right hand side is Sarge himself. He looks right at home here, next to his Quonset hut. And here's another quick look at the cozy cone pool with its cones themed to cabanas. The cones are even themed to cabanas. We've arrived at the Will Well Motel. And here's Sally, looking so nice. There's some gas pumps at the Will Well Motor Court. And over here on the right hand side is the racing sensation himself. Lightning McQueen. Now let's head over to Hourglass Lake and check out the Disney Skyliner. Let's go! Disney Skyliner, now boarding to Disney's Caribbean Beach Resort with transfers to Disney's Hollywood Studios, Disney's Riviera Resort, and Epcot. And here's the Disney Skyliner. Here we are on Hourglass Lake looking at the Disney Skyliner. It's the only floating station here at the Walt Disney World Resort. We're now on Generation Gap Bridge. Just across the way is Disney's Pop Century. The running trail here at Art of Animation is 1.3 miles around Hourglass Lake. Here's the pathway that doubles as a running trail. And if you look just over to our right hand side is Hourglass Lake with the Disney Skyliner and the Pop Century beyond it. Now let's go check out the Finding Nemo themed area here at Disney's Art of Animation. Just behind me is Hourglass Lake and the Disney Skyliner. Off to the left hand side are some guest restrooms. The Finding Nemo section of the resort is themed with the ocean setting featured in the film with underwater plant and animal decorations throughout the buildings. Here's a look at the exterior elevation of the Finding Nemo section of rooms. And if we continue looking on our right hand side, here's the Righteous Reef Playground for Junior Explorers. It's Squirt! And here's another look at the Righteous Reef Playground. And look at these guys, just outside the Finding Nemo section. Dude, there's Crush and Dory! Let's go see the interior hallways of the Finding Nemo rooms and go into the interior section of the Finding Nemo rooms. We're inside the Finding Nemo room building now. On the left hand side are some elevators and on the opposite side is this mural from Finding Nemo. Here's what the interior room hallway looks like in the Finding Nemo section. Here's a door entry and a room number plaque. But let's go back and check out the big blue pool just through those double doors. We're going to go through these double doors here. And just up ahead is the big blue pool. Here's the big blue pool with Animation Hall in the background. And here's the schoolyard spray ground for the Junior Explorers. Here's another look at the big blue pool with Animation Hall in the background. Here's another look at the big blue pool here at the Finding Nemo themed area. Just outside the big blue pool are the restrooms and the guest laundry facilities. Now let's go look at the drop-off pool bar located just outside the big blue pool. There's the big blue pool. Just over here is a ping pong table and off to the right hand side is the guest laundry area. And here's the drop-off, the pool bar, located just outside the big blue pool. But let's check out the menu offerings. The drop-off pool bar has a few featured cocktails, including the big blue ocean for $15, a captain's pineapple for $13, and also on the rocks with a sunshine margarita for $14 and a blueberry lemonade also for $14. Here's the drop-off and over to our right hand side is a refillable drink mug and a soda station for the Junior Explorers. Now that we've seen the drop-off, let's head back over into Animation Hall and head inside to the main entrance. Here's the drop-off over on our right hand side. We're just going to follow the pathway straight ahead here and make a left right up here and head into Animation Hall. 
we're going to make a left here and we're headed towards Animation Hall. And we're going to head through these double sets of double doors headed back to Animation Hall. Here's another look at some animation stills and artist concepts from popular Disney movies displayed here at Disney's Art of Animation Resort. There's the double doors we just came through, straight up ahead of the restrooms. And over to our right hand side is the Pixel Play Arcade. At the moment, it's temporarily not operating, but I'm hoping it will reopen soon. Straight ahead are those double doors that we went through for the bus transportation, but we're gonna make a left and go down this corridor here. Here's some cute little benches. Just over here is a nice little sitting area for the junior explorers to wait for their bus. And here's the main entrance. We're gonna go through these double sets of double doors. We're gonna go outside, have a quick look at the portico, and we're gonna make a right. And we're gonna head down this corridor here. Prepare to fast forward through time and space. Here we are, back at the main entrance again. We've come full circle. But sadly, our journey's coming to an end. Well, I hope you've enjoyed your tour of Disney's Art of Animation Resort just as much as I have creating it for you. With that being said, remember to click subscribe, smash that like button, and ring that notification bell for future channel updates. Also, follow me on Instagram and Patreon. Until next time, see you later, explorers.